Yes, oui, Napoléon. La hip time. Today, put it away, Mark. Just put it away. Is there something you're supposed to be telling me? No. Chopper is Mark Dominic's 2000 directorial debut. Based on the autobiographical works by real-life lunatic Mark Brandon Chopper Reed. It follows Chopper, protagonist of the film and antagonist to himself, for a period of his life in and out of prison, where he terrorises anyone he can. Ah! Have a look what you've done. Eric Banner briefly spent time with the real-life Chopper before this portrayal, and he gives an incredible performance. Well, I mean, humanity doesn't like me. That's why I was sitting here now talking. I'm a bloody freak show. I'm a bloody freak show. Oh, I, 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 I've been laughing at it. Then we'll grab the keys, we'll go through the whole joint, cell by cell, and I will ice pick the fucking spines of every prisoner in this division. Make paraplegics of a lot of them. The film is really about narcissistic rage, paranoia, and I suppose extreme psychological damage. It really does pretty well in not sparing us Chopper's most abhorrent qualities, but at the same time making us feel a little sympathy at least for him. I get the sense that Chopper, the Chopper shown here, isn't really a psychopath but is merely trying to appear as one in order to cover up deep trauma. But then, saying that, a lot of the movie craftsmanship here is about making you wonder. Is Chopper a calculated sociopathic bag of delusion? Is he acting out every impulse? Do these questions even matter to him? Is it all just entertainment? Or is he just going along with the violent, irresistible flow? Tomorrow, alcohol, tobacco. Fire.